Yes, welcome to episode one of the Web of Secrets. Coming up on this week's show. Whoa. No, I'm not having that. That's witchcraft. Clever little bastard. It's not about the tricks with these, it's just listening to him. <laughs> we'll absolutely nail you that job, guaranteed. And then you could, and they were all aces. The Web of Secrets is a brand new magic podcast where we'll be focusing on downloadable magic. You know what it's like, you see a trick, you want it, but you've got to wait. Ah, not anymore. We take a first look, we download it, we review it, and we do a live performance all here on this show. And if you like what you see, you can download that trick straight away and be performing it in no time. So with no time to waste, let's crack on with the first trick. The Evolution Project by Alejandro Navas. Diabolical psychological card magic you can do right through your screen. Ah, oh, moody. Ooh, great camera work. Whoa. A two card transpo through the screen. Don't be the same, don't be the same. What's he doing? Any card at any number through the screen. Come on. I know it's going to happen. I don't know why I get excited. It's going to be there. Otherwise, it wouldn't be on the trailer. I mean, if any of these tricks are even closely, remotely possible, the way that he's showing the endings of them, this is going to blow my mind. I've got to download it now. I'll let you know. Downloading. 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 Loving the method already. Ah, oh, he's using the medium so well. Wow. Ah, oh, that's... Ah, that's genius. He doesn't know which one it is. Ah, I'm so confused. I love it. My head's fried. He's got to do something else here. I'm, I'm going to work on it and try it. I'll see you in a minute. Remember it. Put it in the middle and just shuffle it. Look for your card. Yeah. You got it? Yeah. Take it out. Turn it over. Hey! <laughs> you put two cards off to the side, yeah? I did, yeah. Pick them both up. Don't look at them. Shuffle them. Take any one and put it on your hand. Put your other hand on top. This has already been here before you chose yours. Turn it. <laughs> Fucking hell. Got the cards. Give him, give him a shuffle. Perfect. Spread him a bit. Yeah. Reach in, grab one card. The, the card. card or... Yeah, your card, yeah. Yeah. Take it out. Okay. One, two, three. Whoa, no way. There you go, you see? No, I'm not having that. That's witch you stuff. See? <laughs> you see? You see? I'll tell you what. <laughs> not a chance. The Evolution Project by Alejandro Navas. Modern, fun, entertaining, engaging, and absolutely mind-blowing. I love it, love it, love it. Taking very, very simple, classic methods of card magic and bringing them bang up to date. The instructions are pretty good, but he does leave one or two little bits out. And if you're new to magic, you might get a little bit confused. But if you've got any kind of grinding in the performance of card magic, you'll follow along and you'll make the adjustments accordingly. Absolutely perfect for online virtual shows, which you might think are coming to an end, but I promise you they're here to stay. And if you're doing a video conference call with a potential client for a booking, performing one of these tricks over the call will absolutely nail you that job, guaranteed. I can't recommend this highly enough. Download it now, you won't be disappointed.
So that's pretty much the format of the show. We take a look at the trailer, download the effect, take a look at the instructions, put it into practice, and then do a 60 second review on the effect. It's a brand new show in a brand new style. So let me know in the comments if you like it, because we just don't know. And we're still trying to find our feet. But one thing I do know is that Evolution Project is class. And if you do want to download it, the link is in the description below. And believe me, you won't regret it. It is perfect for doing anything online. But this show isn't just about doing magic online. It's about doing magic in the real world too. And this next effect from an absolute master is designed for just that. The Ogawa opening by Shooter Gawa. Pure eye candy and self-working. Can ask for more than that, can you? With little sleight of hand required. So it's not self-working. Let's have a look. Let's find out what it is. Shoot's amazing. I know that. Here? Are you okay with this? Just say yes. Yes. Okay. Perfect. So it's free choice, right? And I'm gonna divide it like this way. So now I have two pile. I'm not gonna do any tricky move. Just I put one card from here to in the middle. You said stop wherever you like, but somehow we have four aces. Woo! It's good? Yeah, it's good. Thank you. There you go, live performance. Free choice, you can stop wherever he wants. So he's not doing this as an opener, unless he opens with coins all over his table. But I will take only one card from here, just in the middle. You said stop there, but somehow we have... He flashed the six on the bottom, and then you could... And they were all aces, and that's easy to do, apparently. I'll download it, and let you know. Download. Downloading, downloading, downloading. 22 minutes. Follow along like this. Riffle like this. I trust you, stay there. Yes, we're okay. Yes, said yes 10 minutes ago. Talking a lot of waffle. Just teach me. One card from here to in the middle. What's the secret? Ah, okay. Wow. It's already to it. It's a nice little practice tip, that. I'm gonna have a little practice. Hang on a minute, we're only seven minutes in, it's a 22 minute video. What an interesting way to do it, it's almost like a workshop, so you're seeing him teaching some regular magicians. It's showing you everything, so an absolute beginner, if you've never picked up a pack of cards, he can show you. And now he's got a Bugs Bunny cartoon. The next seven minutes is a Bugs Bunny cartoon. That's the most bizarre thing I've seen. I'm gonna go practice. Maybe seven minutes is all I need. If you're looking to do a quick, easy 4 race production, then a Gower's opener could be exactly what you're looking for. Perfect for any skill level, from an absolute beginner all the way up to a working pro. The teaching has everything you need to know, even right down to the finer points of how to hold a deck of cards. With 15 minutes of in-depth teaching, you aren't going to miss a trick, and you'll be up and running with this visual opener in no time. The production quality is pretty good, and the hands-on workshop session is genius. There are plenty of Ace Productions out there. None of them are quicker, simpler, and more visual than a Gower's opener. If this is something that you might want to do, then download it now. Magicians and magic that changed my life. My magic mentor Eugene Berger once told me, for every magic book that you read that was published after your birth, read two that were published before your birth. Well, I've got to be honest, times have changed a little bit. And the way that we consume magic now isn't the same as the way we used to. But luckily, a lot of the old classics of magic are still available for download. And this section is all about that. We're going to be taking a look back at the archives, at magicians that have inspired me, at magicians that have influenced me, and at magic that has changed my life. And what better place to start on episode one than with the man himself, my magic mentor, Eugene Berger. Eugene Berger was my first. 
No, not that. Although he probably would have done if I would have led him. He was the first proper magic book I ever read. I'd never heard of him before Keith Bennett suggested I read Magic and Meaning. And I didn't just read it, I devoured it. And I knew that I had to meet this man. I didn't know who he was. I didn't know where he was. I didn't even know if he was still alive. What I did know is that I was going to make it my life's mission to track this man down. I told my brother about it and he suggested I tried the internet. The internet. I'd never been on it. So the first time I went on the internet was to find Eugene Berger. I typed in his name and Eugene, being Eugene, was already one step ahead of me. He had a website and on the bottom of the website it had a button that said contact. So I pressed it and the first email I ever sent in my life went to Eugene Berger. 24 hours later, he replied. He said, why don't you come to Jeff McBride's magic school in Las Vegas? There's a magic school in Las Vegas. I'm going. So I sold my car and three weeks later, I'm knocking on Jeff McBride's front door. Apparently I was a bit early for the class. So Jeff told me to go and sit in the back garden because Eugene was out there already. And I still remember the first words he ever said to me. He put his hand on my shoulder and gazed into my eyes like he was reading my mind. Fuck you, he said. Matthew, I know. I'm a lot shorter than you thought I would be. seconds in and I'm already well in our fun, playful, so camp. Oh, I forgot about this trick. <laughs> and that little tip there. Oh, you clever little bastard. It's not about the tricks with these, it's just listening to him. I thought that was in my fism act. Ah, <laughs> oh, this is my favourite trick of all time. Such a great trick and nobody's doing it. No one expects it. What an absolute joy to watch. I mean, just look at how forward thinking this is. If, you've, if you're up here and you start twisting your races from here, look at the difference. It's incredible. Now you've got your face and you've got the action and all the things are happening here. Eugene addresses it in this download and it's something you absolutely need to learn. And not just for online stuff. Even if you're on a stage or a parlor show, doing your magic up here is so much better than doing down here. Beautiful, progressive, forward thinking. Writing letters in the sand Lost to ocean's gentle hand Through the sunrise I will thrive Getting out alive Getting out alive When you find that open door You gotta let them love you more Voyagers by Eugene Berger, an absolute classic of magical teaching. If you're looking to take your performance of magic to the next level, this download collection is an absolute must.
If you've never experienced Eugene Burger before, you're in for an absolute treat. You're not just learning magic tricks on these downloads, you're learning a philosophy. A different way to look at your magic, to think about your magic, and more importantly, to perform your magic in a new and meaningful way. The tricks are great, but there's so much more than that. At first glance, they may seem a little old fashioned and quirky, but give them a chance and you'll find out that these ideas have stood the test of time and they're more relevant now today than ever. One of my favorite tricks of all time is on volume two. So if you're just gonna go for one volume, check that one out. But the twist in card handling techniques on volume three is a must see too. Even if you don't learn any new tricks, they're an absolute joy to watch. Highly, highly recommended. Download it now. I really hope you've enjoyed this first episode of Web of Secrets. Please, please let us know in the comments what you think and how we may be able to improve. If you've got any suggestions about what you'd like us to look at, get them in the comments below. And don't forget to subscribe and hit that notification bell so that you don't miss out on the next episode of the Web of Secrets. We'll see you then. Woohoo!